and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kathleen and today's video I wanted to go ahead and share with you guys my TBR for Booktubeathon. Booktubeathon is a week-long very popular readathon that occurs every year and there are Twitter sprints and there are giveaways and a whole bunch of cool things happening during this week and this year it is going to fall on July 23rd and it is going to last all the way to July 29th so it is a total of seven days and I'm so excited for it. I participated last year and I had a lot of fun with the readathon so I decided to of course participate this year there are reading challenges and there are of course video challenges as well and I'm gonna try to participate in every single one of those I might not be able to do them all because they do announce the video challenges the day that it's supposed to go up so sometimes I don't have time to film a video and get it up but I'll try my best I just I'm so excited for my second year doing booktubeathon so let's go ahead and get started with the books that I am planning on reading during booktubeathon now, I will let you know a lot of the books that I'm planning on reading during that week are books that were originally on my monthly TBR. I don't think I can add any more books to my TBR because it's already super long and I don't want to overwhelm myself. So let's go ahead and get started. Alright, and so the first book that I'm planning to read during Booktubeathon is Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell. And this is going to meet two challenges and it is going to meet the challenge of read a book with a person on the cover. So of course we have two people on the cover of this one and also read a hyped book. This book is so hyped on Booktube. It is one of the most popular contemporary books that everyone seems to recommend. Uh, Rainbow Rowell is a very popular author. A lot of people seem to love her work and I said that I would read this book this month because it's been almost two years since I bought this book and it's getting kind of ridiculous so I really cannot wait to read this book for the very first time during Booktubeathon. Alright and so the next book that I'm planning on reading during Booktubeathon is The Crown's Fate by Evelyn Skye. This is the sequel to The Crown's Game which I did read a few months ago and I absolutely loved it. This is also the Biblia Squad's book pick of the month for the month of July and our live show will actually be on July 29th which is the last day of Booktubeathon so I definitely have to get this book done before Booktubeathon ends and this book will be meeting the challenges of read a book you bought because of the cover and I absolutely love this cover it's so so gorgeous and this book was actually mentioned in my favorite covers video that I previously did I'll leave that link down below if you guys like to check it out and this will also be meeting the challenge of read a book with a character that is very different from you and the main character of this book is a magician an enchantress um, a sorcerer a person with magic of course I have no magic as much as I wish I did so obviously a, very, a person that's very different for me so I'm very excited to read this book I have been waiting since I finished reading the crowns game and I cannot wait to finally start reading this book uh. And then the next book that I would like to read during Booktubeathon is actually a graphic novel and it is Saga Volume 4 and this will be meeting the challenge of read a book in one day and read a book outdoors. Now I live in Florida and Florida is unbelievably hot right now and very very humid. I can't stand being outside Florida during summer because I literally melt. So I decided to go ahead and choose a very short book to read it so that I can go ahead and fulfill the challenge of reading Read something outside and I decided to go ahead and go with Saga Volume 4. I know it's not technically a book, it's actually a graphic novel but I'm gonna go ahead and bend the rules a little. So I'm very excited to read this volume. I read Volume 3 a few weeks ago and I loved it. I'm just so in love with the series. I think it's so 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 good and so cool and so amazing. I don't actually have the physical graphic novel with me. I actually just purchased it on Amazon a few hours ago and so it won't arrive for another two days but I cannot wait to have it and I'm gonna- Alright and so just in case I get through through all of those books and get it done and still have some time left over I do want to go ahead and start reading Winter by Marissa Meyer. I read Crest like I don't know a month and a half ago and I just need to finish the series but this book is like 800 pages so it's overwhelming and enormous but the series is so good. I love 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 the Lunar Chronicles series. It's such an amazing story and I just can't wait to finally read this book and finish and find out what happens. 
because I know it's going to be epic and amazing and I cannot wait. So if I manage to finish the first three books, I will definitely get to this book. Alright guys, so those are all of the books that I'm planning on reading during Booktubeathon week, which starts next Sunday. Let me know down in the comments below if you are participating and how many books you are planning on reading because I would really, really love to know. Anyway guys, thank you all so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a like if you did and subscribe to my channel if you're not already. All of my social medias are linked down below including Twitter, Instagram, and Goodreads if you like to follow me. I hope to see you guys on my next video. Have a good day guys and keep reading. Bye!